Well, he's back for season two of the show, all about the consequences of time travel. With me now, Mr. Eric McCormack. Great to see you, man. Congrats on season two, first of all. Thank you very much. Tell us about the show. People have been discovering it slowly, and now we have a second season. It is basically about travelers from the future that have come back to now and have taken over people's lives and their bodies. So walk us through what happened. My character, he's taken over the body of this FBI agent, and so suddenly, he has a wife and a life that he has to maintain. It's very dark and sexy, and it's about as different from Will and Grace as I could yeah. hope for. I mean, you guys look great, and you look the same, and did it just feel like picking up right where you left off? Yeah. Like we hadn't been in the same room as a foursome the whole time. Oh, wow. It had been 11 years, so yeah. all we were getting was a lot of love from people going, I'm so glad you're back. And That's so great. luckily, that paid off. That's Who amongst the cast is the last to learn their lines? <laughs> I sh I'm not gonna name any names. I'll give you the initials. Uh, Deborah Messing. <laughs> <laughs> really, Deborah? Okay. Um, yeah. Who's most likely to break character during a scene? I'm gonna have to go with Deborah Messing again. I'm just ratting you out, Deb. What about who's always on time and who's usually a little late? Uh, well, now we're now we're getting into really ratting people out. <laughs> I I think everyone would agree that probably Megan's the most late. She wouldn't agree because she wouldn't be there yet. But she'll, she'll be here in about, she'll, she'll be there in about 20 minutes. Congrats on everything. Hey, man, thanks Great so much. Great to see you. Thanks for Great taking the time. You. And listen, please be sure to watch Eric in Season 2 of Travelers, available right now on Netflix. One more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.